Happy Friday, Los Al USD. I'm Nicole Pichardo, and this is your wrap up for Friday, June 2nd, 2023. End of the year activities were in full swing this week. While we wish we could include everything, this week's wrap up includes just a small look into all of the fun that took place across all nine campuses this week. We'll start this week with elementary news as our Hopkinson Huskies fifth grade market day. Similar to business day at Lee, fifth graders at Hopkinson learned all about what it takes to be small business owners. Students made products, applied for business licenses, and then sold those products to fellow students, staff, and community members. Lee Elementary hosted its annual Special Persons Day this week. A long-standing tradition at Lee, Special Persons Day honors all of the special people in our students' lives. The event featured special performances from all of our Leos and celebrated the special people that make up the family. Weaver students were busy this week at their annual Leif Steam Fair and Weaver's Got Talent show. From dancing to singing to piano playing and even ping pong, it's safe to say these students sure do have talent. At LAE, fourth graders participated in California History Day. Students rotated through 10 different stations where they experienced various activities related to California's history, like making Morse code necklaces out of pasta, doing laundry on washboards, roping cows, running a water relay to put out the 1906 San Francisco fire, and using sledgehammers to tap in spikes for the Transcontinental Railroad. Rossmore hosted its annual Read on the Green event this week with families coming together with students to enjoy lunch and activities on the lawn. Down the boulevard at McGaw, students grabbed their passports for the annual International Day. As part of the International Culture Club, our sea lions took flight and made stops to Brazil, Korea, Iran, Italy, and the Netherlands. Our special travel buddy from Seal Beach PD, Yosa, even grabbed her passport and joined in on the fun. In middle school news, Oak hosted their student curated art show. During the show, all different types of student curated visual arts were on display, and guests were also treated to some beautiful performing arts from our Oak Lions band. Our McAuliffe Eagles met up with our Oak Lions this week for their annual track meet. Students participated in various track and field activities, including sprint races, shot put, high jump, and long jump. And finally, ahead of their graduation next week, LAHS seniors got to go back to where it all began. Seniors dressed in caps and gowns and walked the halls of their elementary schools, greeted future Griffins, got the chance to catch up with some of their former teachers and staff who helped get them to this point. Well, that's the wrap-up for this week. Stay tuned for a special promotion and graduation edition of the wrap-up next week. And that's the wrap-up! Yeah!